Beginning text-to-speech call with Haley Cooper. Miles, Mr. Atlas just got here. ETA? Oh, man. Gotta find Miss Ferguson first. My stream crashed. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. Uh, can you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Send you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And hurry. <laughs> She's got to be around here somewhere. Better do this quietly. Hey, yo, Miles. What's up, Genki? Can this wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work, and he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh, now a good time? Thanks, Genki. But now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi. Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello. You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no. I'll make it work. That's me. Great. I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. What do you do for fun? Fun? Uh, well, I used to do music production. But it's been hard to find time lately. Genki here showed me some of your samples. Good stuff. Particularly your song called Swinging. What was your inspiration? Uh, yeah. I was, uh, just swinging one day and thinking. Uh, the tune just kind of came to me. Interesting. And can you tell me about what's important to you in life? Being there for people when they need me. Being reliable, trustworthy, someone people can depend on. Very interesting. And finally, why do you think you'd make a great addition to our school? I don't give up. And, uh, I care about doing the right thing. I won't let you down. Fascinating. Well, Miles, thanks for your time. I think I've got enough here. Thanks. Uh, do you want my email so we can stay in touch, or, uh... <sighs> Dad, you could have gone better. Sweet dream. All right, so apparently my stream had crashed. It's been a while since, uh... guys out of the way let's see where that tracker signal leads like i told you i worked for red not osborne what makes you think i know anything about the rtx 35 it's the same all right we need to find a way to get it inside right to miss ferguson's fitness tracker there she is this glass looks pretty breakable now we know Hi! I got you. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's figure that out. I know. In a hostage situation. You hide. I've got these guys. As long as it's appropriate. That's what I'm talking about. I'm gonna get hit. Uh-oh. Messing up my operation, spider brat. Your operation involves kidnapping. How uh -oh. can I almost let that slide? 
I dare you, Spider-Man. Come on! All right. Get the spider. Okay. No, you are gonna go down. Oh dear, I know. Dang it. Messing up my operation, Spider Brat. Your operation involves kidnapping. How am I supposed to let that fly? Yeah, knock him into next week. All right. I don't believe it. You took them out by yourself? It's in my job description. Ready to go? Are you going to carry me? Sure. I've carried people before. As long as I can get verbal confirmation that if I throw up on you, you won't sue me. Uh, consider this confirmation. Just try to tell a brother first. All right. All right, we're here. Thanks to Spider-Man, our treasured teacher, Miss Ferguson, is back with us safe and sound. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider-Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. You are always welcome here, Spider-Man. Thank you. And now? Back to the Quan. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. Not much time. Hi, Miles. I appreciate your dedication to interviewing, but I could tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So, let's do this right, and meet this week on campus, in person. Got a few app requests popping up on BB's campus. 
Thought I'd call you directly. Okay. Oh man, I can't do this alone. Oh. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and see what Pete's up to. Chief Clark, everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely! Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Alright, so... The flame. Oh my. This is a side story. Dang. donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with <sighs> everything. I'll call him right now. But don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. <sighs> Especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. I'll talk to you later. Uh-oh. There's a crime- there's crime happening. Part of the call is bad news. All right. Please don't leave me. There's an ambulance nearby. I can take you to it. Oh my god. Thank you. All right, let's go. You're doing great. Just don't puke. Man, we sure got lots to do, you guys. There. Here you go. You're all set. And I hope the worst is over now. Bless you, Spider-Man. All right. Okay, it looks like looks like we go ahead and take a picture. Not bad. 
Nice. You know, I saw an old grandmaster playing there last week. Anyone could walk up and challenge him. And he lost to a kid who lives down the street from me. Damn. Never seen anything like that. All right. We're here. Emily May Foundation. I was wondering what this place was. Wow, pretty. That's Emily's tree. Em oh! This is perfect. May Parker. You made it. His aunt. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and Parker. And so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Whoa! Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him... Aside for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... He got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, to I heal to the Dr. world. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. So Norman had an offer for Pete? This must be Dr. Young. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, bee -wolf? we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Bee drone systems. Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are shooting them, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Yes! Yep! Oh, yeah. You have a visitor in the lobby area. Gotta protect the hive. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Whee! Welcome to entomology. That looks so cool. If those virtual yeah. bee wolves you just took out were real, 
you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Hey, Miles. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less Same. radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. Hang in there, James. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Dr. Connors! Any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains... Anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. You know who he really is, or was. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. All right, so that let's... was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. All right, let's go ahead and look around. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Yeah, I if Otto. Dr. Connors has used this. The oh, that lizard rampage. He may be done testing his work on himself. Yeah. In case you guys haven't no. In case you guys have noticed, already knew that Dr. Connors was actually the lizard. He did an experiment, a experiment on himself because lizards can regenerate their body limbs. And I believe that he was desperate so to sleep. have his... Where do I even start? And he was desperate to have his arm that was amputated to have it regenerate. Unfortunately, there was a a glitch. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. And yes, Connors had a family. He has a wife and a son. I don't know if they're if they're still together. Origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. That's right. I realize that there are each uh, different uh, forms of the lizard of all the other Spider-Man shows, like the classic Spider-Man and then the uh, Amazing Spider-Man. Excuse me. I should explore as much as I can right now. Looks like looks more like a mall, but Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra efficient batteries charged by bicycles. These bikes. Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Huh. Welcome to Entomology. Beehives 
show complex group decision making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and spreads. The Emily May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honeycomb's vibrational spectra precede a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. There's more of those bee drones. Cute little things. For a drone. I don't like real ones. There's so much to explore. Oh, but I shouldn't keep Harry waiting. Attention yeah, sorry. Don't sorry, Pete. We gotta meet with Harry. Oh, he's upstairs? I know Dr. Connors is a good man. Here he is. Here's Harry. What's that? You really have a particle accelerator? We use That's it an accelerator? The treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. See, Where he's walking on? normally. Top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Oh, Even way back. Before high school. To middle school. Okay. Please. Now, do you know the. Hang on. You're I a may have a good guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the Hang stuff it. everyone studies in middle school with Rivor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. It's so calming and... We're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. Uh, whoops. Sorry. Got it. Mm -hmm. Are we gonna meet? Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Dr. Foster, huh? Oh. Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. No spoilers, the Willie! The combination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Okay. 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 Well, is this some sort of puzzle?
Oh. Never mind. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. Uh-oh. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Oh, man. This is... Okay. Okay, if I combine these traits... Ugh. This doesn't make any sense. Oh, okay. One step closer to feeding the world. Are you nice serious? Work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Are you serious? I hate puzzles. This is probably going to take a while. What next? It's supposed to be... Oh, thank you! Beautiful work, Peter. Ugh. Using thank you. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested. Oh. Very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember. 
The things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. I think I got... I think I got someone mad. Come on! I'm so excited for you to see this. Okay, I think okay. I got... I kind of lashed out at Haven Knight. I don't want to get ahead of myself or anything, but I think you're going to like it. If it's anything yeah. like the rest of this place, Harry, I'm sure it's awesome. Go ahead. Swipe. All right, swipe, huh? He already told me a few days ago. He already told me about the collapse. He already told me about the collapse at the bridge. That some car, that some boat co- I guess I'd better swipe my badge. Oh, will you- hush. So, yeah, Michael is Haven Knight. See, weeks ago he had, um, he apologized because he got so angry at his deadbeat dad that he took his anger out at, at us a few years ago. And then I, and then for me, I kind of, I already know about the bridge. He doesn't have to tell me again. Because of this dang curse I have. Wow. Man. Harry. Yeah. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Emily May Foundation. Really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. It's not going to be easy. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud. Huh? Yes, Chris. It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. Oh, he's accepting the <laughs> offer. Yay! Good for him! He needs a job. Ah, <laughs> cute! I don't know how long... I don't know how long Pete and Harry have been best friends. I'm, I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. Uh, it's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. Coney Island? <laughs> yes, Chris. <laughs> I told you that uh, it's because of his deadbeat dad. The good news is that he's living... On his own right now, away from that deadbeat hey, I father. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. 
All right, I'll swing by. All right. Wow. A little to Tokyo plant. Wow. Oh my goodness, there are lots of... All right. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... It's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. This isn't big trouble in Little Tokyo, okay? All right. Uh... Let's go ahead and do this one. Real, there. I realize that there are tons of side stories. Oh, what's up, Dana Casters? I've seen the questions about that new Emily May Foundation. Who are they? What do they do? Well, uh oh, picture, it's an Oscorp spinoff, which we don't like. Sorry, but, uh... Guys, you're kinda getting sand everywhere! You guys should really leave and go somewhere more tropical! Awesome. All right, let's go in and get the crystal. Let's see what memories. Let's see what memories. It's my turn to follow them. Figure out who they are. I end up at this abandoned school in Harlem. And I'm already beginning to regret this. Marco must have felt so alone during all this. His back against the wall. I can relate. So he was lonely and isolated himself. Kind of reminds me of that. Uh, kind of reminds me of Riz, the brown bear from B Stars. If you haven't heard about it, if you haven't heard, um, B Stars is a anime that you can find it on Netflix. It's really good, and the third season will be coming to Netflix soon. I mean, it's going to be split into uh, two parts. And it's the final season. Alright, Chinatown. Some jerks are trying to break into that building. Look out for a reason. Spider-Man's going down! Peek-a-boo, I see you! Here we go! All in a day's work for a neighborly Spider-Man. All right. Yeah, B-Stars is really good. It's about a gray wolf named Lego Shi that's been... I mean, there's been a, a herbivores... There's been a tension between herbivores and carnivores. <gasps> And Lego Shi had fallen in love with a little dwarf rabbit named Haru. And then there was a, and I, I don't know if he, he has a friend, a red deer named Louie, who happens to be the former student at the Cherryton Academy. And he was also, and he was supposed to be nominated for the next B star, but unfortunately, uh, things didn't go so well that. Louis was cursed because uh, 
when he was a child, he had a permanent marker named, called number four on his bottom of his foot that he was going to be devoured by other carnivores at the black market. But luckily, another another red deer who that took him and Louis got adopted, thinking that he could change the world. Hey chief. hey, chief. Thanks for coming. We've managed to set our explosives in every zone except the last one. The demo crew's in there. There's four of them. I'll find them. Just keep your radios open. And make sure nobody touches that detonator. No. <laughs> Spiderbot can search faster in there than I can. Your time to shine, little guy. Make Spidey Daddy proud. Spidey Daddy, how <laughs> cute! Okay, it's time for the little shop for the little spiders. Spider drum. Spy Spider Daddy. <laughs> Spidey Daddy. <laughs> That's cute. Is anyone out there? Help! Is that a robot? Hey, Spider-Man. I just relayed your location to fire and rescue. So they'll be here any minute. It's gonna be okay. Spider-Man. Thank you. That's cute. Mark, did you get the location I just sent over? Our team's moving in now. Thanks. Spider-Man's here. It's gonna be okay. Alright. I did manage to see God Kong and Godzilla and Kong, the new empire today. It is time to test out my pulse blast then. It's really good. Yes, it was a rat. Dang! For a little drone. Hang on. Hang on. I'll get you out of there. <sighs> Thank you. Help coming. Fire and rescue knows where you are, and they'll be here soon. You're going to be okay. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Clark, you should be getting a new location any time now. Just All right. Ahead. We'll head right over once we finish getting Mr. Robleski out. What are those breathing exercises again? All right, so Okay, so uh we need to find a way to get over there. Blast through where? Oh. Well. Blast through where? Stupid weak wall. I, 
I mean, I see. Oh. Oh, I had to go between the under the wheelchair. Silly me, duh. All right, let's keep moving. Okay, stop checking. Okay. So So how do I uh Oh. I just had to back up. Dang for a little drone. No, it's not earthquake. There's no earthquakes in New York. So it's field testing time for my latest upgrade. Initiate high jumps. Whee! Hey Clark, did you get the last location I sent you away? Heading there now. There's only one other worker left inside. Hurry, Spider-Man. Leave it to me. I can see my said someone else is still trapped in here. Really? We're not missing anyone else. But if you can find them, we'll get them out. I'm on it. Jump! Uh, Purple jacket. Whee! Nope. Just oh! Crap! I missed. My bad. Note to self, do not get on the electrifying floor. Okay. Whee! All right. Whee! Good. All right. Whee! Good. Whee! I gotta stop doing that. <laughs> No, I didn't crash. I accidentally... I accidentally had the drone. Yes, thank you. It was by accident. Uh-oh! The prophecy? The flame? As soon as they're done with the deserter, we're out. The explosives will bury whatever's left of him and the evidence. You're gonna kill someone? We gotta be caught. Well, it's up to the drone. Oh.
All right. Whee! Wait, I've fought these people before. Organized what? And fanatical. Yeah, I'm getting big cult vibes. What about the intruders? Cult! Bad news! Well, that can't be good. The flame is disappointed in you. Who's the flame? Got any details, anyone? What are they? Oh no. I didn't say anything to the police. Never, never even mentioned the flame. I just, I just wanted out. Then you should have remembered we all go out the same way we He wouldn't! Painfully. Alright, you cult scum! Get out of here! The fool's beacon! Paul should know! He said you face us eventually. Prophet? Oh man, I've always wanted to be in one of those! Not crazy about the nickname, though. Wait, we faced these guys before. So, what's my prophecy? Endless fighting, death by building, throw four arms and become a giant man spider. That's it. Oh, okay. Uh oh, the building won't stand. Hi, Cody. Welcome to the stream. The carnage. Ow! 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 Carnage. I even watched the second Venom called Venom 2, Let There Be Carnage. Death to you, father! What the? Who are you? Who the heck is she? Is she an ally? There you are. Hey. You never did like my smoking. Smoking's bad. You're Hello, Samantha. Welcome to the stream. Little lives call me Wraith. Wraith. That's pretty well, I think. I tried. Where have you been? Oh, they—they they know he—he he knows her. What about them? They made their choice. This will be a new record. Yuri. Details. Ooh, caught in the net. He said it couldn't be done. Looks like Yuri took off. I thought she'd just need some time after what happened with Hammerhead. But coming back with that suit and a name like Wraith? I should keep an eye on her. 
And the other on these cultists. I need more eyes. We got plenty of skills. All right. Wow, we sh We do need a lot of upgrades. All right. I see. All right, let's go ahead and upgrade some skills. All right. I don't think we won't have time to continue with our story, so... Let's go see what Miles is up to. Moving. All right. Thing I've attempted all week. I'm in. All right. We probably won't have time. Jameson, two words. Okay. Why is it so hard for some people to follow the rules? Shut up. Can you help us? All right. Everything okay? Lance, he was kidnapped. By Lance. Don't you guys have like a huge game against them tomorrow? That's the whole point. Look, they explained it in this note. All right. If you're reading this, you're probably a wannabe scientist of BV. But you'll have to do some midtown level science to finish our puzzle and get Lance back. 
Don't worry, though. If you don't, we'll make him look real nice in front of everyone. Good luck. Here's your first clue. The boat has sailed, but should you steer, you solved our puzzles engineered. Good luck. Signed, RJ. Shoot. Pretty sure that note leads to the Stewart building, but we can't access it. We called you? Yeah, I'll look around. Mm, that RJ kid. I knew not to hold the door for him. Wait, the Stewart building? Wonder why the Midtown kid stood glance there. Did you find him already? Not quite, but I have to know. Why the Stewart building? A BB kid won a robotics contest against Midtown at Stewart Robotics and Engineering last year. Midtown lost. Hello, Von. Von. Like Midtown is super bothered about it. They'll be even more bothered when we get Lance back. All right. It looks like RJ left another note. Okay. Lights up. Lance, I need to shine the UV light on the mural somehow. Light. The light always reveals the truth. Is this some riddle? Hmm. Maybe I could reangle these beams. Sure that old box won't mind if I just give it a little love tap. I'm gonna skip this puzzle. I just hit a message. I knew it. We BIPOC artists are birds of a feather. To find the next clue, all a band together. Hmm. BIPOC artist. Haley's the art expert. Let me give her a call. Alright. I heard you're looking for Lance. Did you find him? Not yet. Midtown's making us work for it. But I could use your help. Sending you a pic. BIPOC artists. Birds of a feather. Hmm. There's a bunch of BIPOC murals at Rodney and Third. Don't know what Alabama means, though. Thanks, Haley. I owe you one. That thank you was plenty, but I'm always down for coffee. You got it. All right. Ton of murals here. Oh dear. I a message on one of them. How are we doing? I'll find land soon. I think. Midtown's hidden messages on murals around town. Right now I'm at Rodney and Third, trying to find the next clue. Where Anders Oliband's painting is? <sighs> Makes sense. Oliband? Midtown mentioned him in the clue. But who is he? BB's own premier art prodigy turned research fellow at the Musée de la Vie in Paris? Maybe Midtown's jealous they don't have an alum like that. Okay. Okay. The All right. Competition is stiff, but your tactics are stale. The greatest in the region shall soon prevail. Hey, Haley, got another clue for you. Sent a pic. Hmm. 
greatest in the region. If it's about another mural, you might want to try North Williamsburg. Didn't BV and Midtown have a chess match there last week? Yes. Regionals. End it in a stalemate. Aha! That explains why Midtown's so bitter. I'll check it out. All right. Two murals this time? Man, Midtown really doesn't want us to find Lance. Uh, I think Brooklyn Visions has Spider-Man on their side. Uh, no. I am not doing that. Finally. Okay, what's it say? 1121 Main Street. That must be where they're hiding Lance. Hey, Miles. Speak on it. I think I found Lance. 1121 Main Street. Knew I could count on you. Man, where'd they get all this equipment? This setup is impressive. Like, ridiculously impressive. they even have time to set this up no 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 uh no Haley are you kidding me no Haley's deaf got time to set up an elaborate puzzle around this yes <laughs> she's deaf that's why she's she has a she's wearing a hearing aid and she has some kind of AI talk on the phone. Lance. Lance. Here, buddy. <gasps> Lance the lion. Speak up, boo. Time for you to head home. One of you must be RJ. Spider-Man? No fair. Brooklyn Visions cheated. Whoa, Spider-Man? Guess BB couldn't figure it out on their own. Thanks for the fun and games. But I've got to get this guy home. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry, kids. Any luck? On my way back. And I'm bringing a fluffy friend. Lance! You found him! Is he okay? Did it hurt him? Looks safe and sound to me. They had him in the garage. It was kind of dusty. He might need a bath. Anyway, hurry back. We're all ready for him. Let's hope he... <laughs> Let's hope he doesn't ha He's not allergic. I know. Spider-Man got him back. You did it, Spider-Man! Thanks for getting Lance back safe, and just in time for the game. Oh, we got another. <sighs> Looks like we got a another side sort of a side quest, but um Unfortunately, we won't be able to proceed because I'm running out of time since that my stream somehow crashed all of a sudden. So, anyway, too bad nothing shocking has happened that we probably won't be able to see uh, Craven and the other hunters for a, for a while now. So, anyway, I'm going to end the stream for tonight, and we'll continue with Spider-Man 2 on Monday. Hopefully this time that my stream won't crash this time. Anyway, I thank you guys for coming. This is Dragon Wars signing out, and I'll see you guys on Monday, and I hope you have a happy Easter. So, good night, everybody.